Hello and welcome to the Scarlet Scoop's Valentine's Day special. I'm your host and multimedia editor, Chelsea Spears. Love is, or at least the early phases where we're um, sort of intense feelings of love, are similar to what happens with um, early exposure to drugs and abuse. Okay? I'm saying this not because, not uh, any kind of moral or ethical thing, but just because the same kinds of neurotransmitters and brain areas can um, activate it. Okay, so even if you don't have a significant other this Valentine's Day, some puppies had plenty of love and smooches to give this Valentine's Day week. Assistant multimedia editor Hannah Chinetsky got up close and personal with the pups. Love is in the air this holiday season and these pups are looking for some smooches too, as well as to raise awareness for Pets for Vets. The doggy kissing booth smooch pooch was put on by Pets for Vets to raise awareness about the benefits of companion animals and the lives of military veterans suffering from post-traumatic stress disorder. Originally we Pinterested uh, fundraising ideas and a doggy kissing booth is a popular one um, and it ties in therapy dogs really well so we kind of took that idea and uh, ran with it. Even though the purpose was to raise awareness, some students just stopped by to pet the dogs. And why'd you stop by today? to pets for vets. Dogs. Sears says that what dogs can do not only for veterans but for everyone is amazing. What they can do, put smiles on all the college students faces that are in the building um, and we're giving out um, different flyers and valentines just to show um, what we're all about. For Lantern TV, I'm Hannah Chinetsky. Thanks, Hannah. For those of you who do have a Valentine this season and maybe waited till the last minute to make a dinner reservation, we found a site that might help you out. It's called Open Table. Here you can type in the location and the site brings up lots of restaurants in the area that take reservations. You can click on each restaurant to see what times are still available and then, here's the best part, book the table online. Well, some people aren't going to be needing that site because they already have plans. We went around campus Thursday and asked students what they're doing for Valentine's Day. Here's what they had to say. My girlfriend doesn't go here, so we're kind of just Skyping. Um, not for like the whole entire time, but we might just Skype, have dinner over Skype. Like I'm actually going to an event put on by H2L and it's our West Moral boys are throwing a dinner for all the girls on the team and so they're just gonna serve us by doing that so I'm really excited. And on a note of love, happy anniversary to the Orton Bells. They might not be wedding bells but they are some beloved bells that mean a lot to people here on campus. And as of this week, they've been ringing for 100 years. Here, listen to these chimes and we'll leave you on that note.